All right, so I just got the bow. Uh huh. I have one key. I have to get back to the end of that hallway. Okay. The Duma key. The Duma key. That was a terrible book. Mm. Couldn't get through it. And we're back. Wahoo. Wahoo. Party time. It's party time. So one thing about this level, this temple, is that it's very easy to get yourself turned around. And I think I want to go this way. That way? Yes, that way. Oh, okay. <clears throat> the music's kind of irritating. I always thought it was creepy. <clears throat> okay. Oh. I don't think I wanted to go this way, honestly. <clears throat> I think I messed up on the going this way portion. Oh no! Yeah, I did. You already opened that key. Yo, you open. I already opened that key. You already opened it. What's up? Mommy just wants to know what's up. She always wants to know what's up. Huh? She always says, "Hey, what's going on?" I mean, I think she wants to tell you what's going on. Well, That's I already know what's going on, so I don't think you do. <clears throat> So we didn't even talk about how we saw Shazam today. <gasps> we did. It was good. It was good. It was fun. It was definitely nice to see DC pumping the brakes on the whole, we got to be Marvel, you know, V2 and do all our crossovers at the same time. Yeah. But it was a lot of fun. <clears throat> uh -huh. The actors were all good. It had good uh, emotional impact parts. Mm -hmm. And the action was fun. It was <clears throat> funny, too. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, and they definitely played heavily on the fact that they were part of the DC universe, but yeah, <clears throat> but it wasn't like heavy. It wasn't ham fisting it. Like it was right. like, it was like yes, yeah, Batman, and Superman are things, mm -hmm. but that's pretty much it. Mm -hmm. I went the right way. No, I'm good. Okay. I feel like I've seen that that green block a few times. Well, you know, sometimes you gotta see a green block a few times. Oh, okay. I don't know. I'm just saying. I saw that green block. A few okay. Times. You just sort of like. Oh, I feel like I've seen that green block a few times. <clears throat> I think I said like I feel like I've seen that green block a few times. I guess. I guess you did. <laughs> I guess you did. I'll allow it. Watch out. Bip bip. Bip bip. Yep, up. Yep, up. I think there's a treasure chest in there, in there. There is, but you have to use an arrow to unlock it, and it just gets you more arrows. So that's really dumb. Like, I think that's already open. It is already open, but shooting it untwists the library. Or the hallway. I don't know why I said library, but I'm pretty sure that I have to have it not be twisted, or do I? Hold on. I already got that. No, we don't need to be in here. I have to twist it back up. Man. I didn't even know that the thing you said was the thing that happened. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, I'm sure I knew that at one point. Yeah, you beat this game, so there was a point in time where you didn't know that was a fact. And it goes, whoa. And the reason I was saying before that this, I thought this was the creepiest dungeon is because the music creeped me out. Oh. And, like, the whole atmosphere of the dungeon was creepy. Mm -hmm. Like it wasn't like the shadow temple and the well, the the um, the beneath the well are creepy, but they're like, you can tell they were meant to be creepy. Oh my god! So it kind of like, there we go. It kind of like um, it, it dilutes the fact because mm -hmm. <laughs> they are. But for some reason, this one is just a little bit more. Like this feels like a building that was like something once and it was abandoned like a million years ago and now it's just <laughs> ghosts and goblins. plant monsters and goblins and yes to an extent goblins that's a cool game too ghosts and, ghosts goblins. and goblins i heard it was impossible <clears throat> it's pretty tough and then once you beat it you have to beat the whole thing again right i don't know no oh. i never beat it no. well now's your time to shine <laughs> <laughs> i know i'd never be able to I could probably beat the first couple levels, but that's about it. Yeah, that's like me in Castlevania and Ninja Gaiden at this point. Yeah. Yeah, those are definitely games where you have to like sit there and just play them until your brain explodes. Yeah, you're not going to be speedrunning. Uh, well, <laughs> somebody is, but... Somebody once told me. Okay. That's like what I wanted to do. 
That's like what I want to do. All right, so let's talk about bad movie remakes. I think this was your topic, so go okay. for it. Well, um, let me think. So it's funny that you mentioned that because, well, it's not really funny that you mentioned that, but um, so everyone knows that the Brendan Fraser mummy movie is a remake of like a 1930s thing. Mm-hmm. Have you ever seen the Tom Cruise re-remake? Uh, parts of it, and it's I said, terrible. "I said this is dumb." Yeah, it was terrible. Well, that was when they wanted to <clears throat> make a a dark universe. Um, uh, yeah, a movie monster universe. Yeah, and that that went real, uh, real swimmingly. Well, mostly they, because the mummy tanked it. I didn't say they made it through one movie, so. Well, they had two, I think. I'm pretty sure that Dracula Untold was supposed to be part of it originally. Oh yeah, that stupid movie. And pew. Um. I was also, for some reason, the other day, thinking about the RoboCop and the Total Recall uh, remakes. And that's like, why? Why would you, like... Man, I 100% forgot that they made a RoboCop remake. Yeah. Like, why? There's no reason. They're good movies to begin with. Remake bad movies if you want to remake stuff. Yeah. Like, I don't can't really pull a bad movie. Like, a, if they had a bad movie with a good concept that they could remake, then <laughs> do that. Mm-hmm. Like Fantastic Four. <laughs> I mean, they've tried that a few times. Yeah, they, the second time they tried it, it was even worse, so. Maybe Marvel will do a better job. Come on. Just. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, since Fox owns, uh. Or Disney owns the world now. Mm hmm. And I think this is where I want to be. I drop down here. Yep, there we are. And you're on a chessboard. Are you going to play wizard chess? No. I'm going to play Don't Get Smashed by the uh, the big giant thing in the top of the roof chess. Oh. I forget what's in here, though. Is there anything? Is there a reason for me to be up here? No, there's not. It sounds like there's a little gold school tool. It does sound like that. That's a good point. <clears throat> Going jump, 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 jump. Let's see if we can find him, shall we? I don't know where he is. So, we'll come back to that, and then we'll make sure that I got the one from the beginning of the dungeon, because I don't remember if I did or not, or if I just said, there's one, and then just ignore it. No, I did. I yeah, you did, because you hookshotted him. I hookshotted him. Oopsie, watch out. The ceiling is falling down. There you go. And just, oops. Oh, I'm gonna get smashed. There we go. Is this a thing? Or you could just not do what I wanted you to do. Oh, I don't Smash! think I needed those. Oh. I wasted precious seconds. <clears throat> well, it's fine, because that was a safe spot anyway. That'd be kind of mean, actually, if they made it not a safe spot. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. That would be the easiest slide puzzle ever. What, what the the lore logic of this puzzle is? I mean, like, I don't think this, any of the did puzzles. Did this ghost in here. love puzzles or something when he was alive? Maybe. Maybe he was a puzzler. Maybe he was the puzzler. Maybe he was just puzzled. Mm -hmm. Although this one, they don't give you a thousand years for. I gotta say. Like, I mean, I guess it's pretty obvious when you you know when you see it from the top, but mm -hmm. maybe it's not obvious for everyone. It's a mystery to everyone. It's a secret to everyone. There we go. Whoa, 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 Link. hey, hey, whoa. And he was like right on top of you. Yeah, he was. <clears throat> I'm trying to think of what other bad movie remakes I've seen lately. Um, I was sure the Thing prequel wasn't too bad. The Thing. Yeah, it was with, uh, what's her face? Uh, Ramona Flowers. 
And it was about the... I don't know if you ever really saw the thing. But it was about the, the ice... Norwegian ice base that started off the original movie. I can't say that I've uh, seen any of that stuff that you're talking about. No. It's a good movie. With uh, Kurt Russell? Yeah. Yeah, the Kurt Russell one I've seen. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, they made a remake that was like about the the team that they find in the beginning of the original one. Mm-hmm. Um, but they used a bunch of CGI and it looked like crap. No. Oh. But otherwise, it wasn't too bad. So they used poor man CGI. Right. Yeah, they used the, the you know, dollar store CGI. Mm-hmm. And it looked like poop. Yeah. Somebody once told me the world was gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. Yeah. <laughs> Good news is, you're full of hearts now. I am full of hearts and full of farts. I'm pretty sure we made that joke before. Probably. I'm here for you! Amen. Yes, yeah, she's Dr. Stranging me. Do, 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 do. It's really not difficult at all, though. Isn't it like the one who moves first? Yep. As long as they actually do it. There it is. Oh, as long as I don't screw it up. You blew it! Okay, well, I guess I'll have to... There we go. Just gotta be like, uh, like Quick Draw McGraw. Mm. Uh, so we were talking about remakes. Oh yeah. Do you have any in mind? Um. Or is there anything coming out of the remaking that they should not remake at all? Oh yeah, there was something. Um. And I feel like I'm gonna have to use the Googles on this one. All right, come on. Just I, I've proven that I can do it. Just just die. There we go. <clears throat> Apparently they're going to be remaking Labyrinth. Really? Yeah. Isn't and that one of those movies where it's like, why though? And Men in Black... Well, aren't they doing the one with Chris, uh, Thor? Maybe. And it looks stupid. Maybe. Where did that come out already? I don't think it came out already. And we already talked about the Shaft movie on the show. Yeah. Which, I mean, to be fair, is a sequel. Yeah. I never saw the first Shaft, but I just thought it was funny that they were like, mm -hmm. they were like, mm -hmm. let's do a sequel to Shaft. And I was like, really? Is that Was that like a ground-stopping cinematic masterpiece that you just gotta bring back? So apparently they're making a... Not a remake, but a sequel to Big Trouble in Little China. And it's gonna have The Rock in it. Uh, What about Kurt Russell? I don't know. I mean... Apparently John I'm, Carpenter was pretty upset. Oh. Uh, I was gonna say I'm pretty okay with that, but then no, I'm not okay with that. We already know about Hellboy. We definitely have already talked about Aladdin. Oh, yeah. Oh, apparently there's a Highlander re re reboot in the works. Why? I don't know. Those movies weren't that good in, any, in the first place, honestly. Uh, apparently, opinion. um... Oh, my God, what is wrong with The me? dude who's directing the John Wick movies... Is going to be directing it. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. I mean, well, uh, I mean, I just totally contradicted myself because I was like, why don't they remake movies that weren't that good? And then you said, they're going to make a Highlander remake. And I was like, those movies were really not good in the first place. <laughs> so <laughs> we're going to we're gonna back off on that one, me. <laughs> I'm going to pump the brakes. Because <laughs> that's actually a pretty good idea, and they should totally do that. Uh, they're going to be doing... A animated Adams Family movie with I did Finn, hear about that. Finn Wolfhard as Pugsley. And uh, who's the dad? Somebody's the dad. Um, I mean, obviously, somebody's the dad, but you know what I mean. Yeah. 
Oscar Isaac. Oh, maybe not. Nick Kroll is going to be Uncle Fester. Charlize Theron as Morticia. Chloe Grace Moretz as uh, Wednesday. I'm not a uh, not not too crazy about her. In general. Oh my God! Is this for reals? A Masters of the Universe movie? Wow, Adam's going in the. Uh... Oh, hey, buddy. Although, okay. apparently, it's going to be attempting to compete with Star Wars Episode Nine, Jumanji 3? 2, I think. It says 3. Oh, oh, I think... I guess because The Rock one was supposed to be a sequel to it. Yeah, I guess. Oh my god, can you just... Alright, if this is not open... Well, apparently, they're going to do a... Um... Apparently, going to do a updated crow with Jason Momoa as the crow. Uh, I feel like that's Jason Momoa is too beefy to be the crow. Yeah, wasn't the whole thing with the crow was that he was like scrawny and like a yeah, punk? he's like yeah, and he what is wrong with uh, me? Maybe labyrinth. Oh, I see what I did wrong. <sighs> maybe here's a here's one that never needed to happen and is still gonna happen again. Charlie's Angels. Ugh. Well, I mean, that, that kind of... Well, I don't know if Charlie's Angels is really good source material to begin with. Yeah, that's Honestly. True. So... I'm not going to lie. I have not been paying attention to the game at all. For that's good, because it, I've so. been I've been circling around the clock tower room for way yeah. longer than I should have been. Well, the good news is I'll get to watch it when, you know... Yeah. When it... when it I'm, I'm like, you know, Justin Timberlake in it over here. Saying, what goes around, goes around, comes all the way back around. I was waiting for it. I was like, now what's he going to reference? <laughs> I think once you figure out this puzzle, it's time to take five. F. And F. F. I already opened that one. Oh, I figured right it out. <laughs> you knew the whole time. No. No. All right. No. So Mr. before Superman we go ahead long. and... Uh, Ready to wreck this boss? We're going to take five? We're going to take five. We'll see you in a bit.